time between May and what was it, May and, and July. That was a really good time for me. All right. So Amazon FBA, you guys, fulfillment by Amazon. You can do sell.amazon.com or you can go on Google and do Amazon seller. All right. You hear a lot of different wordings for this because it's so it started as drop shipping and then it moved. It, it's still evolving, okay? Uh, and it's sorry, evolving. Kenyon, sorry, one second, my dear. One second. I wanted to announce that we have two new members. We have Thomas Patterson as well as Peter Zaquan Jones. And I just wanted to let them know what they're listening to so that they are not confused. Uh, this is our presentation for tonight, teaching us about FBA, which is fulfillment by Amazon, guys. So Kenyon is teaching us a whole lot of information in the Amazon game because there's a way to make money in all of these different circuits. And as soon as we're done with this part of the presentation, I want Peter Zaquan Jones and Thomas Patterson to introduce themselves to the ECI. Real quick, um, give me one second, uh, Kenyon, because I see there is a hand up. Uh, Mr. Andrew Beard's hand is up real quick. Do you have a question or anything? Oh, yes, I, I, I heard um, the, pre the presenter mention many different um, accesses to the Amazon uh, sales um, uh, site. And uh -huh. I was wondering if a person is able to uh, use all of those um, sites or are they limited to once they register, they're um, committed to the one that they register with. So are you saying, can you do Amazon affiliates and Amazon fulfillment at the same time? Precisely. Yes, you can. I do it and I have my EAs work on my affiliates. So I don't even focus on my affiliates anymore. <laughs> they focus on that. So you can set it up like a whole business. Cause like I said, when you can do the blogs and such, you can make it very intricate and do a whole lot of things with it. Interesting. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Kenyon. All right. Keep on going guys. There's money out there and we have ways to make this money overnight all day sorry real quick kenyon likes to say i think it's kenyon who likes to say make your money make money for you while you sleep right exactly while exactly go ahead thank you sir yes yeah, so like she said there's money out there you guys okay so the popularity of amazon is indisputable all right Amazon leads with the ranking of the most popular shopping apps in the United States with one point what is that 150.6 million mobile users accesses the Amazon app and that was just last year okay so Amazon isn't going anywhere they just declared Jeff Bezos the richest man in the world this is not the only thing but I'm just telling you that this is a very lucrative thing if you focus put your energy in it put all your time that you can all right, it's a great way to sell products to thousands of people from all over the globe, okay? Because you can, once you get into it, you can end up having a store with the U.S. Um, branch, and you can have a store under uh, Europe, you can have a store in Japan. There's different Amazon um, platforms, so you can end up getting stores and doing different things. It's, it's a big thing that you can uh, get yourself in, okay? So how do you maintain this just from your phone, all right? I told you guys a little bit about those add-ons and things. So who I used and who I came through was uh, Joshua Crisp, okay? So I joined him earlier this year. I actually saw him on Shade Room, and I didn't believe it at first. I'm like, okay, whatever, you know, let's see. And uh, he was doing a free training. So we do the free training, and out of, you know, I just had that inkling, like, okay, let me just buy in because you need to learn and understand the power of investment, okay, especially with this. This is going to make you elevate yourself uh, if you don't have already a, a knowledge of a business functions and business systems. This will definitely elevate you um, because you have to treat it like that. You have to get a, a, a quality manager and someone to come and inspect your uh, pieces when they go to the to the warehouse. You have to go there and inspect your units and the things of that sort. So this gets very um, intricate later on down the road. But just seeing all of that really encouraged me and made, made me want to get into it. So plugging myself in, working from home, I did it on my phone. Now I have a computer, do it on my computer. How do you find your products, you guys? There are certain ways you can find your products, and typically it's expensive. So that's what I'm saying. You have to learn how to invest in yourself, okay? So I have a link that actually gives you 50% off. It's through Joshua Chris. Um, it's my affiliate link that I have from him. 
Um, and you can get 50% off of your Jungle Scout, okay? If you do Jungle Scout, uh, that is a great way that it tracks your P&L. It tracks uh, all of the searching that you need for things. Like, it breaks it down for you, and you don't really have to stress uh, because it, it does all the algorithms. It shows you the averages of the pricings. You look up different products, for whether it's eyelashes or whatever it is, candles. <laughs> it's out there in the world, and they keep track of it. They have an algorithm that helps you understand. Uh, what I use and what's from my uh, – my mentor, Joshua Crisp, is AMZ Hunter, okay? You can do amzhunter.com. Um, right now, we're still in the growing process. So at first, I was one of the first 100 members, uh, but he has now opened it up due to the Black Friday and the holiday time. So you can be the next 100 or next uh, whatever amount he's opened it up to. I don't remember, honestly, but um, he has created the same type of platform, um, but I love it because it's more intricate, okay? Uh, if he breaks it down a whole lot more, um, and it's a lot more affordable, okay? So the website is very fluid, all right? You have Product Hunter. So basically, like I said, you type in the product, and it will help you cross-reference it wherever it is, whether it's on Amazon, whether someone's selling it on Shopify, whether Walmart has it. It gives you the average pricing. It gives you a sales estimator. You have able to um, save it and export it. So that's what I have my EAs do. They look up and they search things during the day. And then at the beginning of the week for the following next week, they export everything to me. And then me and my COO, we look through everything. And he and the product manager, they go through and they order what we feel as though it's going to be profitable. And then, yeah, you go from there. And then you got to learn how to get ratings and, and add people and have clients and models and people to help you uh, push it. It becomes really um, intricate through there, okay? So there's no surprise that Amazon is making billions because there's so many opportunities out there, right? There's over 23 official languages recognized in Europe, and that's just in Europe, okay, you guys? So here they can't even count it because it's still going. It's still people being added. It's, still, it's just a big melting pot. So there's so much opportunity. Use your uniqueness. Like I, like I put in my tip for myself, I'm Native American, Dominican. I, I use my uniqueness okay so I talk to people I, I, I'm able to have that you know just that more compassion for some reason when it comes to animals and the earth so that's why I use that with certain people use your uniqueness use who you are use that for the products as well you know so I believe in 100% organic products I believe in 100% natural products so we use products uh, Laura life and things like that so that's what we sell um, that's outside of Amazon but I'm just just telling you uh, just a basis of how you can go, okay? So no matter where you can live, you can start your own online business, all right? So there is no more waiting. This is your confirmation, okay, you guys? This is it. If you want to do more, if you want to learn more, like I said, you can join the private Facebook group. Um, we are going to actually start breaking it down even more. Me and my team have been working on it for Muggle University, but I also do want to give it out for free to people. Um, but I do know statistics, and they say that only 7% of people who take courses actually finish them. So I would like to give it to you for free and prayerfully you will listen to it and make some money because I left my job in August of this year. Uh, I walked away and I made 88000 in Amazon that month. Um, and I can tell you that this is very beneficial. And uh, I don't know if you can see me. I, I'm not sure if you can see my screen. But it was all from this product right here, okay, you guys? No, can you please see that screen? That, all right. He said eighty-eight thousand dollars. I'm away. Okay, you can see it in the group. I posted it before my uh, my records and such, so no. you guys can see it. This is all proof on there. All right, there is testimonials. There's get connected, you guys. Um, I'll open up the floor now for questions. Now go ahead and exit out my screen sharing because this is it. Oh, well, yeah, this is my milestones and stuff. But. Where's your milestones? Put that back up because you got me <laughs> wide open, sir. Milestones yeah. and 2020. I saw two little things. Um, this is what it's all about. Oh, he, he exited out. No problem. That's oh, no, sorry. I was trying to come back so I can see y'all and oh. talk to y'all. Okay, no problem. Well, yeah, like that was amazing. First of all, thank you so much, sir. Um, you know, with the Economic Crisis Initiative, the best way that we can really 
make a difference with our building of wealth is having multiple streams of income. And what he just shared is just one of those facets and he is giving it to us for free. And that's why we are creating this hub of you know innovators and entrepreneurs and those that really wanna see our community strive because the more we give is the more we receive. And then also the more we share shows how much we care. So thank you so much, Ken, for that. Um, he also does a great demonstration with the quadra quadrants, um, the four steps that he learned many years ago uh, from the Mr. Kui Kuisaki, Kui you know what I'm talking about, Robert K Kiso. You know that guy. Andrew, your phone is muted. <laughs> I always have a problem with his I, name. I got you. you yeah, know. Robert Kiyosaki. Um, that was um, Rich Dad Poor Dad. Yes, yes. Yes. So um, Ken also does that. But real quick, does anybody have any questions or concerns for Mr. Ken? And then we'll go back to introducing Thomas and Peter. I have I'm a good. I, don't need, I'm, I understand what's going on. You understand. Thank you, Thomas. OK, Mimi has a question. Yeah, so how many? Um, how many websites did you have to set up to get this thing going? Um, that's dependent on you, honestly. So I, at a time, had a blog already. So I started adding in there just, you know, the top 10 um, camping tools or the top 20 um, dessert books or whatever, you know, and I just started throwing random things in there. Um, and then from there, my team, you know, once I got a team and such, they started, you know, coming up with different ideas. And then they started adding up more blogs and more different uh, types of websites. So it, it depends on what you want to do, um, because when you do sign up for Amazon affiliates, it is going to ask you, how are you going to, you know, promote this or how are you going to boost this? So that's going to ask for like websites or your Instagram handle or your Facebook handle or whatever you're using. They're going to ask for that, you know. Um, and you can also, um, <clears throat> if you're doing it on your computer and you're doing like the boosts and the ads and stuff like that for Facebook, you can also um, do it where you do like the thumbnail where it comes on the side. So when people are still on their computer or whatever, you know, they're seeing the products being advertised. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll definitely take that into Mimi, you're breaking up, Mimi. You're breaking up. Can you guys hear me okay? Yes, now. I said we'll definitely talk. We'll definitely yes, talk. That yeah, is, we'd love to know more. That is so beautiful. And that's <laughs> such a great question, Mimi. And you know what? We're in a present world of nothing but, you know, likes and views. So why not get paid off of our likes and views and different things exactly. like that? So that's what I'll be working on more this week as I'm working on my different projects for sure. Anybody else? Or can we go ahead and introduce Thomas? And Peter. All right, Thomas, you're up. Thomas Patterson, hey. my big bro. Hey, y'all, how y'all doing? My name is Thomas Patterson. You know, I um, appreciate the invitation to participate in this in this program, hoping that, you know, we could put our heads together as a unified body and get the best out of it. Um, I'm, I was interested in something like this, so I'm going to just sit back and it was going on, so I just familiarized myself with the process. All right. Can you hear me? Uh huh. Uh huh. You said familiarize yourself with the okay, process, right? Okay. Yes. Okay. We got you. Well, this is being recorded just to let you know for our notes purposes. Some people feel uncomfortable, but it's not going anywhere. It does get uploaded on YouTube, but nobody's looking for us or trying to find us. So you will be able to go back, Thomas, and watch, you know, from the beginning. And um, of course, share information within the group um, on our WhatsApp and all of that too. So I'm excited that you're here, big bro, because I know you have a lot of energy great energy and great resources and information. So welcome, welcome, welcome. And uh, Peter Zaquan Jones is here as well. Hey, what's up everybody? Good afternoon, good evening. Um, I'm just here to learn. Um, we was talking on last night on the uh, IA show, you know, about how you can make your money work for you. And this is such an awesome opportunity. Um, we, as people of 
color. We have to understand, you know what I mean? We are always at the bottom of the barrel. And I think it's time for us to rise to the top. If the Jews can do it and everybody else can do it, we can do the same thing. It's mind over matter. So I'm just here. This is this is awesome information. And I'm just so glad to be, you know, part of the movement. Awesome. And I thank you so much, guys, for joining. And as you all know, um, the reason that this in, this empowerment group and this economic crisis initiative is so important to us in the community is so that we can have these conversations, we can share resources that really can help others, but also help ourselves. So both of you guys, make sure I have your email addresses, because what we do is we send out this economic checkup, a financial checkup, which is to see your budget. And and we don't like to say that word B for budget, but it's not to come back to me or the group. It's for you to keep to yourself so that you can actually put in the figures, right? And see where you are with how much money you make every week or every two weeks or whatever, and then how much you're spending. So that's super important. Um, you know, uh, Ken shares about this often about, you know, being healthy, you know, and, and you cannot, uh, you're welcome, Kenyon. Um, you cannot have empowerment or, you know, special things going on if you don't feel good emotionally, financially, spiritually. And so that's why we're doing this too, so that we can all be on the same page. We want everybody to feel really good mentally, emotionally, spiritually, financially, um, you know, all the leads, and then we can work towards bettering our community shortly thereafter, right? And uh, now I wanted to share real quick, if anybody doesn't have any more questions, or if you want to wait until later, uh, because we're running um, into eight o'clock already. Oh, 718, sorry. Um, oh, go ahead, Ken, talk about I'm it. I'm sorry, this was the product. <laughs> A pair of scissors? You got when you find when you find out certain products that you can use, you can use certain products and you can actually get labeling. So you can learn how what understand what white labeling is and different type private labeling and all of that. And you know, you can own that. So a pair of scissors. Whatever else buys, you have to buy it from you too. So then that's how you start making money too. A pair of scissors. Mm -hmm. See, see, we we don't get these, you know, details and this information, but thank God for people like Ken Yan, aka Ken Dadon, who knows this because he showed me a pair of scissors and this brother getting paid, paid off of some scissors. Praise God. Listen, Ken, we have to stay connected more and learn from the king himself, okay? So that's the product he was referring to earlier. And I think we all can learn a lot because at the end of the day, that's why we're not as wealthy, right? A lot of these resources and a lot of this information is not privy to us unless we go deep into finding out certain things, or we align ourselves with people that are on the same page, right? And so Ken actually mentioned it earlier, how if you're in a room of four idiots, you're the fifth idiot. I think that's super smart of him to share that because we're not in a room of idiots tonight. We are in the room of movers and shakers, people that really care about our people in our community and are here to make a difference. And that's what it's all about. So real quick, guys, I just wanted to share that uh, on the 11th, we finalized the location. We have our location for that workshop. Mimi will be joining us from overseas. Well, over a big, you know, bridge or something. Canada, Canada. Is there a river that, no, there's a lot of stuff that, you know, separates us, Mimi. Um, Niagara Falls, so she'll be c communicating. <laughs> Right through Niagara Falls, because she's right over the water there. We love it, love it. And um, but anybody that wants to join us, we have our banker. So our investment banker is definitely making a grand appearance with a whole lot of information. We're not gonna say their name because of the recording. I'm sorry, somebody saying something. Oh, I think I was hearing something. Um we are not able to say their names because of the institution that they work for. So anything that we do with this particular entity, we have to remain, um, I don't wanna say silent about it, but we have to be very conscientious because of the work that they do in investment banking, but they are totally for this movement. And they were one of the first people I spoke with in regards to moving forward. So I'm excited that their schedule is free 
and they know so much. And just to let you guys know, um, you know, within the stock arena, you know, portfolios, IRAs, and different things of that nature, your girl Anaya A is reinvesting directly with this particular entity. Um, I don't have a whole lot. I'm not a multimillionaire yet, but we're working on it. We are working on it. And one of the things that we have to do as a people is we cannot stay stuck. If we feel like we're not moving in the direction we want to go in, you know, be like Ken, be like Mimi, get that information, right Mimi, right Ken, get that info and go forward. Do not stay stuck where you are. If you feel like you want to do a different thing, go out there. Thomas Patterson and I had a conversation today of different things that we could be doing together in the community. Um, Peter's same thing. We all communicate about the same ideas. Now it's time to put them into effect. So on the 11th, which is Friday, December 11th at 6.30, well, let's say six o'clock, we will be meeting at 2.15 west 125th street on the fourth floor um make sure you communicate with me before you show up because of the pandemic we can only have 10 people live but the rest of the community will be able to zoom right in and watch our presentations um and hear um the special information i would love for mimi to present that night i would love for ken to present that night um and anybody else that feels like presenting anything to get people on board. We're now opening up our, I guess, our weekly meetings to the public. Um, and it's just going to be like a certain amount. Like I said, they're being recorded on YouTube. But if you're not blasting it or having all sorts of um, tags and things like that, it doesn't circulate as rapidly. So, so far, we've had like four views, five views, and that's predominantly from our group um, because we want to make sure that we're all on the same page. And plus, I would love to see us do a lot more, but we can definitely talk to some, you know, legal advisors in regards to this because what we're doing is really important for our community, but we want to make sure we are A-OK. -okay. Um, does anybody have any questions about that? Now's the time. I guess everybody's on the same page. Um, Andrew Beard's phone is muted. Ken is muted. Um, it's okay. It's okay. Listen, we got it from early on. We see the movement. We see the things going. Peter Zaquan Jones, are you still with us? I I'm hope here. you are. I'm here. Excellent. Um, last but not least, um, we're going to be talking about very soon after this first workshop, real estate. I don't know if you guys know, um, but that's all a part of this wealth building and growing, right? Um, in New York City right now, we have over 15,000 units available. Now, that's for renting and things of that nature. However, there's a high probability that some of these are condos. Some of these are homes. Due to the pandemic, we're actually at, I think, a buyer's market where we are able, look at Ken. Ken is already thinking. Ken is already about to jump in and get some land out here. That's all right, Ken. You better come through. I will definitely be checking with you for more information. Thank you, Andrew. Of course, we're excited. And Andrew, if you would like to share any work that you do within the community as well, get ready um, because I know that your heart is for the community and the youth. So if you have any youth in your communities that you think will be able to participate in what we're working on, bring them on board. We are now, I'm back at you, sir. We are now opening it up for those that are younger. And again, um, we're opening up our sessions to the public because I feel like we've developed a unity in our community. Um, in regards to real estate, again, so after this workshop, I want to bring some real estate investors and real estate uh, people on board. Uh, Thomas Patterson and I were talking about this. And matter of fact, Peter Zaquan and I were talking about this as well um, in regards to real estate and things like that. Um, when they say 15,000 units, it could be a number of units. It could be, again, condos. It could be homes. It could be, you know, apartments. But we are in a buyer's market where we need to take advantage of this pandemic. How do we get loans? How do we get grants? Um, you know, there's a lot of first-time buyers grants out there, $10,000, $20,000, you know, and people want us to buy. Now it's up to us to get that information to move forward. You guys agree? 
Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, I feel like people tired tonight, honey. This weather is getting colder. Mimi is in a whole uh, zone right now because that that's no hit and it's beautiful. But I don't think Mimi wants to go nowhere outside, honey. That was a whole blizzard that hit. How are you doing out there with all that snow, Mimi? Yeah. Tell us. Well, we are in lockdown right now. So, um, yeah, Toronto's back in lockdown for 28 days. So everything is, hmm. there's no outside, guys. <laughs> oh, no. So literally, you can't even go outside if you wanted yeah. to. No, everything closed. Oh my God, I'm yeah. so sorry. Oh my God, I just thought it was because of the snow, Mimi. No, <laughs> we're oh. in lockdown. Started two oh. weeks ago for two more weeks. Two more weeks. Well, we're yeah. going to keep you in prayer. Thankfully, we have the senior pastor on, senior chaplain pastor. I think we need a prayer um, before we shut down tonight because honestly with everything going on yes there's some ups but then there could be some downs so spiritually speaking that my heart is breaking for you and for everybody else that's experiencing that right now mimi oh my god that is crazy that is crazy wow um wow we just have to stay encouraged we have to encourage our sister mimi stay connected lucky you want to you want to encourage her as well i think lucky wants to encourage you Come here, boy. Thanks, <laughs> He's like, yes, let me encourage my sister. Well, um, listen, we are going to shut down um, in just a moment with prayer. Um, don't forget, the 11th is our workshop. Um, I'll be following up with the team members to see how everybody is, to see what's going on with our communities, and also to make sure that everybody's okay, especially during this season. Sometimes people have emergencies, like there were a few tonight. Shout outs to Ty, who was literally about to join us, and then she had an emergency, so we're going to pray for her family. And then David just got back into town, David Cuspert. So I think he's really exhausted from his holiday traveling. Um, so we're lifting him up in prayer. Um, every time we shut down, I do a little exercise to re-energize us and to remind us of how amazing we are. Because as we move forward, guys, we have to keep in our minds that we can do this, that we are winners and that we are moving forward. Right, guys? We are energized for greatness. And that's what it's all about. And then after our little part um, and our affirmations, I would love for the senior pastor, uh, the senior chaplain to close us out in prayer because our dear sister Mimi and probably millions of others are in lockdown mode. Lucky, get off of my tree. Lucky is on my Christmas tree, guys. And that's not cute. Hey, Lucky, come and say hi to the people. Okay, Lucky says hi. Woo, he cannot be on my tree, guys. All right, so we're going to shut it down and guys get ready for our workshop. I think we have one more session until our workshop and I'm super excited about it. Get ready, get ready. So right now we're going to do our affirmations for the newcomers. It's basically to reinforce our greatness and our spiritual power and our energy. We're going to close our eyes or if you want to keep your eyes open, that's fine. And you're going to breathe in through your nose and out through your mind, out through your mouth. Sorry, breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. One more time. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. And at this time, you guys can repeat after me or you can say it in your hearts and in your minds. I am beautiful. I am beautiful. I am wonderful. I am wonderful. I am created for greatness. I am created for greatness. My future is amazing. My future. I am already rich. I am already rich. I love my community. I love. I love my people. I love my I really love myself. I really love myself. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. And my brother, 
Peter Zaquan Jones, please close us out in prayer and lift up our sister Mimi, who's in quarantine presently, as well as millions of others in the same predicament. Amen. Shall we pray? Father, we thank you for the for this gathering on tonight, God. We thank you for every person on the Zoom call. Father, we thank you for the information that was shared, God. We thank you for the presentation. God. Father, we ask you, O oh God, to keep downloading information of wisdom and knowledge to this young man, O oh God. We thank you for his yes, O oh God. We thank you for his willingness to, to share this information to empower us, O oh God. Now, God, we pray for Sister Mimi, O oh God. Father, she may be locked in, O oh God, but she's not locked down. God, we ask you, God, to bless her, God, even in her situation, God, we ask God that you would that you would be with her, oh God, and let her know, oh God, that even in the lock-in, oh God, that there's still blessings flowing from heaven. Father, we ask God that everybody on this live, God, we pray for prosperity, God. We pray for health, oh God. God, we thank you because even in a pandemic, oh God, you're still prospering even in this, oh God. We thank you that your people are still being blessed, oh God. We thank you that bodies are still being healed, God. Now, God, as we as we get into this to this new endeavor, oh God, as we get into this to, to this wisdom, oh God, we ask God that you would anoint us afresh, oh God. God, we ask that you would keep us in your loving arm, oh God. Keep us and protect us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much, man of God. That was absolutely positively beautiful. And I love each and every one of you. Listen, guys, this is only the beginning. I'm going to do my rounds to see how our team is doing. Mimi, we love you. Be encouraged, my sister. You're going to make me cry. Oh, my God. We have to be here for each other during this very critical time. And don't forget, don't forget that... Um, Many years ago, when there was the Great Depression, that's when the most millionaires came out, huh? The people had no choice but to save up, to learn different ways of making it. And as they tried their best to fight what was happening in the economy, I guess they just really tapped into their inner strength. So right now, as we leave each other physically on this Zoom, remember this thing called inner strength. And there's a power. There's a power within each of us to not only build and grow, but to multiply. Let's multiply our wealth and let's shake this nation one person at a time. Guys, I'll be on the Anaya A Show in just a few minutes and I'll be shouting all of you out. If you guys want me to share any details of your organizations, your companies, whatever you're doing, send me a message ASAP or just join me at 830. I love each and every one of you. Thank you so much for your participation, your prayers, and get ready for this workshop because we are multi-millionaires. Come on, let's do it, guys. I love you guys. Thomas Patterson, Peter Zaquan, Robert thank you. Marshall, Kenda Don, and Mimi. Thank you so much. Y'all have a great night. Great night, guys. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you, Anaya. Thank you, Mr. Right. Rohan. Thank you, guys. All See right. you soon. Mimi, yeah. I love you, boo. Good night. Good night.